Hey guys! It's Hannah here. And today, I am here to show you all of my LPS Cocker Spaniels. I do not own every single Cocker Spaniel. I am missing a few. I'm not really sure if I ever will get them. They're not really... Uh, they're not a priority right now, but we'll see. But I'll show you the ones I'm missing right here. But either way, let's get into the video. And as always, I will show you them in the order of their number. So it's oldest to newest. All right, so the first one is this one. This is not my first Cocker Spaniel, but I do believe that she might have been my second one, actually. I remember getting her a couple of years back from a Swedish site that's similar to eBay. And I was so happy when I first got her. I was just getting into Cocker Spaniels back then. And I remember that I pretty much, pretty quickly after that, I think I made my uh, video LPS hands, where this LPS is kind of the, she was kind of the main pet in that video. But this one is actually very special because she doesn't, I mean, she, yes, she does have a number, but she's actually a variant. And I don't have the pet that she is a variant of, but I will show you a picture right here. So yeah, they are quite different, but as you can see, the design is pretty much the same. Next up is this one. And this one, I believe I actually got off the same site that I got the last one I showed you. And I actually got her with, I think it was a few, maybe not Cocker Spaniels, but I remember there was a few Great Danes in there. And yeah, it was a pretty great deal because I got very, you know, usually expensive pets for a great price and you know i was so happy when i was able to find that that was such a great deal next up is this one and this one is very special this design is very unique there's no pet like that so i really like this one for that and i actually think of this one as a guy i always have and yes obviously i do think that cocker spaniels can be used as guys um i know that some people think that it's kind of confusing <laughs> i've always think that some cocker spaniels do look like guys so and this is one of them and i think that this might be my favorite guy cocker spaniel actually next up is this one and this is another one that I got for a great deal, actually. Maybe, well, it was quite expensive, but I'll, I'll explain why it was a great deal. You see, this one was, well, obviously it's an old LPS, but she was released, I think, originally in like 2006. And I found her new in package on eBay in like 2012, 13. I can't really remember, but it was a few years back. So yeah, I mean, that was a long time after she was originally released. That was just amazing to find that whole package and all the pets in there and get, you know, getting them completely new. Next up is this one. And this is another one that I actually look at as a guy. Um, this one I think could be used as both though, but I, I don't know, to me it's a guy and always have been kind of, so yeah. Next up is this one. And another guy, in my opinion. And once again, this one has a pretty unique design with kind of spots a little bit all over him. And I just think that is very unique and very cute as well. Next up is this one. And this one is very special to me because she's actually one of the very first pets that I ever bought from eBay. And maybe that sounds a little strange to say that that's special to me, you know, the first pets I got from eBay. But to me, it is really special because considering that pretty much most of my collection of LPS have been bought from eBay, most of them. I mean, that's quite a lot, as you can understand. So, so the first order I ever put on eBay, she was in that order. I actually did do a video when I first got these pets, and I think it was called my new LPS dogs from eBay. Or something like that because I happen to get on the dogs and I've also used her in one video that I can remember right now uh, on my channel and that was in Vera Valentine as the mom in that video next up is this one you might think of a certain LPS when you look at this one but there's something different isn't it yeah this one is very special I'll show you the other LPS that she reminds you uh, pretty much everybody of uh, later, but for now I'll just talk about this one. So 
This one is very special because she came in an Australian exclusive set. She came as a bonus pet with some other pets in that uh, set. And that is like one of the rarest sets ever. So yeah, this kind of is making her one of the rarest pets ever. And even like the most hardcore collectors have a hard time finding her so for me to be able to have her is amazing and i'm so happy about that oh my gosh she's just so pretty i love her she's so 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 gorgeous i love her eyes and that's pretty much the only thing that's different about her compared to the other one but she was released first so yeah but oh my gosh i just i just love her next up is this one and this one i actually traded from my friend lexi or most known as go green girl i was so happy when she was willing to trade this one with me i mean she had used this one in a couple videos i just couldn't believe that she was willing to trade her and oh my gosh she's i mean being used she's in pretty much excellent condition it's just amazing i remember i was just so psyched when i got this one and just seeing the video that lexi made that she wanted to trade this one that was amazing for me and i myself have also used this one in a couple videos because she's just so versatile somehow you can use it for a lot of things i have used her in my fashion shows a few times and i also used her in my video trapped where she plays the character Paula. So yeah, this LPS is just, she's very special to me, as you can tell. Next up is this one. And this one is just so cute. I just think her eyes are so adorable and the little flower she's got here. And one thing that's very special about her is I guess her colors because there's no Cocker Spaniel like this. I mean, it's kind of a lilac grayish color it's very pretty very unique not just for the cocker spaniels but for all the lps overall i think there's not a lot of pets with this color so yeah she's definitely very unique next up is this one and this one is also very special to me and that's mainly because she played a major role in kind of a major video on my channel she played adria hills in my video simply fabulous yeah that video kind of started as a mini series and then i put all the parts together to make it kind of as a movie and it ended up being like almost 40 minutes long and that's i don't know if it's a record or something i know it's a record for my channel yeah it was a lot of work but it was so much fun and that video has just gotten amazing feedback and that's why this one is so special to me now because when i look at her i just see a lot of good things so yeah i love her for that next up is this one and this is actually the one that i was mentioning earlier when i was talking about this one and now maybe you can see where i was coming from they are pretty much twin sisters they look a lot alike as you can tell the only small difference uh is the eyes as you can see this one has got kind of kind of squarish eyes while this one is more rounded um also, this one is a little bit lighter in the coloring and this one is a little bit darker, more yellowish. Um, but I just think both of them are so gorgeous. The, as I said before, when this one was actually released before this one, if I ever used them in a video, they should definitely be related. That's what I'm saying, that, because they look so much alike. But this one is actually one of my favorite LPS. And I actually, I do think she was a part of my top 10 yes she was um she's just so pretty i love pets with this color i don't know why i just it's such a pretty color and the blue eyes just go so well with it and she, you know she looks really great in pink maybe that's why i like her so much because i love pink next up is this one this one was my very first cocker spaniel that i ever got and i remember that the set that i got her with i did not get it for the cocker spaniel it was like a four pack i think but now i'm so happy that i did get that set this one has been used a lot and she was actually part of one of my very first series on my channel it was a series i made even before lps cool and that series was called the miley life it was kind of a crazy series, but I had to delete it because I used copyrighted music and well, that's not allowed on YouTube, so you can't see it yet anymore. But yeah, this one does kind of have a special place in my heart because of that, because it was one of my kind of starter up things on my channel. So yeah, 
Next up is this one. This again is a guide to me and kind of got the same designs as this one. So in a way, this is kind of like a newer version of this one, but it's not really, but it's just similar design. Uh, I really like them both, but this one I think would be my favorite out of the two. Yeah, this one is really pretty. I like it a lot. Next up is this one. And this one was also used in my video Vera Valentine. That was last year's Valentine special. When she was available in stores, I actually was not really interested. I don't really know why. Now I really like her. I mean, she's very pretty. I mean, she did come with a Blythe doll. And when the Blythe dolls were new, I was like kind of a rebel and be like, no, I'm not buying any of the packages because I don't want the doll. But obviously some of the pets from those packages were really cute. So I was kind of missing out. And I realized that a couple of years later and that's when I got this one. So now I really like her. She's really pretty and she's got pretty unique design as well with the kind of dots on the ears which is really adorable and the flowers here it's really really cute next up is this one and i think this might actually be my second favorite cocker spaniel she is just so pretty being you know a very much a collector i got kind of surprised when i found it a cocker spaniel that I did not know about. I fell in love immediately. I didn't get her immediately though because it was, you know, hard to find. She's pretty rare. But when I did find her on Amazon, I think it was actually new in package. I was so happy, so, so happy. And I am to this day. I'm just, oh my gosh, I just love her. She just looks so friendly and kind and pretty and cute. And oh my gosh, it's everything. I love her. Next up is this one. And this one is so cute. It was, well, I would like to say that it's a Valentine special, but actually it's not. But it's got a lot of hearts, as you can see. I think it was for the Nintendo LPS game. I can't remember what it was called, but I do believe that it was an exclusive kind of to that game. So yes, but this one is just so cute and I love the design. It's so pretty, though. I don't know if you can see that, but mine has got like a cracked head. It was like that when I got her. I don't really know how that happened, but yeah, that's kind of unfortunate. But other than that, she's in really great condition, so that's great. And then last, but certainly not least, I have got this one. And this one too was used in Vera Valentine. Yeah, I used quite a few Cocker Spaniels in there, but that was because they were a family, so. And this one is one of the rarest Cocker Spaniels there are. Um, I don't really know why. She, I found her in stores in Sweden. She came with a Blythe set. At first, I was not really drawn to her. She's kind of, I mean, it is a pretty unique design. But then after a while, after seeing her, you know, in stores kind of over and over, I fell in love. And now I do love her. She's so pretty, so, so cute. I'm just really digging the whole unique design thing right now. I just really appreciate when Hasbro did something different. So. All right, guys, so those were all my Cocker Spaniels. I might be getting more since there are a few ones that I still don't have. I guess only time will tell. <laughs> but either way, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you soon.